Welcome to UC Today. My name is David Dungay. We are here reporting live from Jitex 2022 in the wonderful Dubai. I have with me Anthony from Wavenet and Ali from Avaya. We've got, we've got some incredible news coming up. Ali, take us through that news and what it means for the channel. Yeah, hi, David. It's good to be here. Good to see you again. So, yes, yeah, so we're expanding our one cloud portfolio um, in the UK and our channels will be really pleased to hear that we're actually launching a private cloud offering um, with Wavenet as our chosen strategic partner. Um, what does that mean to the channel? It means that, again, you, well, effectively, it's a wholesale offer. So the partner can take the solution um, and, and, and do what they need to, provide their own service wrap um, and own the customer. Fantastic. Uh, Anthony, tell us from your side uh, what this means for Wavenet. What kind of value are you going to be bringing to this new offering? Yeah, look, it's um, so thanks, David and Ali, for inviting me out here. So to be clear, there's two things here. Um, one, we, we're in a, a via partner ourselves, right? So we've got a large base of customers and we've got many other different platforms in our portfolio. We, we've spent the last 12 months, maybe 15 months, developing a, a, a UC, a via proposition, kind of an IP office in the cloud that is suitable for our customers. So we've been working with them to develop that. Then the second thing we've realized is actually, you know, what we're good at is wholesaling products. And as a partner, we kind of know what we want because we kind of need it ourselves. So we, we're going to put a full wrap on this proposition and get it out into the Avaya partner base. And, and all we're going to do in the middle is provide them, our partners or their partners with the platform to provision, uh, support, deprovision, amend, make ads changes, and get the CDRs from Wavenet to build those customers themselves. So th this is um, quite a departure from the strategy just two years ago or so. Um, Ali, outline that, that opportunity. You mentioned it's a wholesale offering, giving partners control. You know, what, what does this mean for partners who are uh, you know, in the Avaya stable right now? I think um, we know that we launched a public offering and that public offering is absolutely here to stay and there's a place for it in our portfolio. But we have a huge, um, a huge base of, of, of actually very loyal partners out yeah. there that want a wholesale offer that want to be able to provide their own their own solution effectively, um, and they've not been able to do that for some time. So we're bringing we're giving that I suppose that flexibility and that agility back so that they can go they can take the offer uh, and and use it in their own service offering. So it's it's really exciting. And Anthony, that that control that we talk about that we uh, the channel partners in the UK they they seem to love having that control. How how important is that? It's massive, um, you know, partners own the customers, right? And they're very emotionally attached to them. Um, so for them to have full control of this and full billing of this, it's, it's critical for it, for it to work. The, the other thing Ali mentioned there is, Avaya partners are very loyal to Avaya, uh, us being one of them. But that also our customers of Avaya products are very loyal to the, to the products and the brand as well. Um, this private cloud proposition will allow them to convert from on-prem to cloud, fully fully cloud proposition. And actually some of the hardware they've already got funds for, they can still utilize, which is a massive point for when they actually migrate away. So partners watching this today will be eagerly awaiting the timeline. When are they gonna be able to get their hands on this, Ali? So it, absolutely, early in Q1, um, in line with our CCAS uh, rollout, so yeah. Fantastic. And Anthony, I mean, what are you going to be doing on your side to get this in the hands of the partners between now and then? Yeah, there's two things. So one, the partners can wait till Q1, it becomes released and you know, they'll get access to it straight away. What we'll be doing in the next coming months is lots of webinars, maybe some roadshows, definitely client visits, so we can share with them what the product's going to bring, how it's going to work, and actually get these partners signed up. So they're, they're not waiting for you know, Q1, it takes probably a quarter to get that round. So I think if we start engaging with the partners ASAP, really, as soon as we're back in the UK, let's go. Absolutely. Well, uh, Ali, Anthony, thank you so much for joining me. Congratulations on this new uh, uh, partnership, if you like. I'm really excited to see where it goes and uh, enjoy the rest of Jitex. Thanks. Thanks, David. And thank you for watching. You've been watching me, David Dungate, on UC Today.